Hello everyone, Jace here, back with our episode of my Yu-Gi-Oh! Poké Duel Nuzlocke Challenge Run. So last time we got to the second floor of this Pokémon Mansion, so we'll just continue exploring. Diary, July 6th, Cairo, Egypt. This pain is unbearable. Shadi replaced my left eye with this Millennium item. I saw a v vision of Cecilia. I must learn the meaning behind this item. Okay, so they did- so the creator did change the lore of the Pokémon Mansion. Instead of it being the birthplace of Mew, it's uh... I guess Pegasus's old mansion. And we're still having to deal with high encounter rates here. I mean this whatever. I'm getting close to level ups at least. And as once everyone gets to level 48, we should be good on the boss, the uh, gym leader once we actually get out of here. Uh, let's just do Stark Ega Draining. Yeah, everyone's lo running low on PP though. So maybe I should just take a... Try to get get to a Pokemon Center to heal up and then come back to this place. I'll do that later though. And the glare. As always, you just got this these Pokemon just gotta make me waste my full heals. Uh that was the wrong move. Did not want a quiver dance there. I was gonna try to do a flamethrower, but ah uh, man, we're running really low on PP on our attacking moves. Paralyzed, nice. It's getting really unlucky with this specific battle. It's the first battle of this episode too. Twice in a row, okay. You know that that's perfectly fine. I I just love getting paralyzed. That missing play is costing me like 10 turns or something. Three times in a row, you know, that it's only a 25% chance. So, what, that's like a 6.25% chance of that happening. Okay, finally. And I could have ended way earlier if I didn't miss some put there. Uh, well, gonna have to waste this full heal and probably in our healing item. Do I even have any ethers or something? I don't think so. Let me just check to see if I have any ethers. I do have two max ethers, and I do have two ethers. Uh, you know what? This might be the first time I ever use ethers, because usually in Pokemon games, I don't bother, but like, this is just super annoying to deal with. Yeah, let's give F Flamethrower some more PP, and we'll just continue onwards. So we blocked that place off, but down here is open now, so we can see what's down here. A Dark Geroid, of course. This Flamethrower should take care of it. Okay, one one more hit. Like, I don't even know why Ethers are really in Pokemon games anyway. Because, like, you can't buy them. So, they're pretty useless, honestly. Like, I, I usually never end up using it. I'm only, like, using it now because it's just bothering me and I don't want to go back to the Pokemon Center. But like I think ethers are like one of the more poorly designed parts of Pokemon because like they're rare, so you don't want to use them. But like they they aren't used that useful anyway because PP doesn't run super low until near end game where all your moves have less PP, and you can't buy them anyway. Like the Pokemon devs should just make ethers viable. I don't understand why they aren't.
And if they think it's super valuable to heal PP or something... Okay, Gwen's finally leveled up. So now we can swap her out. I guess... Hmm, who should we be swapping to? I guess Ariel. Ariel does need one more level. And I'll just go back to cycling through two mana again. So that doesn't lead anywhere? I guess that switch is pretty useless then. Oh, not, I should use the ether on Ariel too, because that surf is getting low. Um, well, Ariel's level 48 now, so never mind. I'll just swap back to mana and have her take care of everything. Let's see. Yeah, this is blocked off. Uh. Okay, I guess we gotta hit the switch again and just go upstairs. I think we're supposed to fall through down. It's been a while since I've played this part of Pokemon. These Pokemon games. Like, the last time I played this part was like the Let's Go games, which was three years ago at this point. Whatever. Uh, well, let's hit the switch again. If we won't get interrupted every 10 seconds. Extra Sentry should take care of this guy. Uh, well, at least he flinched, so I don't have to deal with damage. But she is, mana is not killing these people, these uh, mons. Okay, well, let's hit the switch. Actually, there's the stairs up here, too. Uh, I don't know what the difference is, then. Since we're already here, let's go up st these stairs and see where they lead. Okay, what's up here? A Pokemon collector and a diary. February 6th, Cairo, Egypt. I haven't left these tombs in six months. I've discovered these ancient shadow games that were played in ancient Egypt. I must recreate these shadow games. I'll call it Duel Monsters. I'm heading back to the Industrial Illusions next week. Interesting. And a Max Potion. Nice. Uh, extra sensory. Okay, yeah, he's just gonna waste his turn on Wish, and he's not even gonna survive to see it. Okay, let's get into this trainer battle then. So it's it's. I guess I have to do the other uh the other stairs to actually progress. This place is like huge. And it's another tuber for some... Uh, I still don't get why they're called tubers. Like, it's super weird. But, let's see, this guy is a poison type, so extra sensory should just deal with this pretty easily. Yeah, one hit KO. Aya! I wonder where my partner went. Uh, I'm pretty sure he's downstairs. Unless that's not your partner, and you're you're all just around here. Like, why are there so many robbers in this place? There isn't even that many good items here. I guess that max potion is valuable, but you can literally buy some of these items in like the Pokemon. I don't, I don't understand why robbers would need to come here. Well, there's another switch. Uh, before we hit that, I guess we can just look around. And there's an item. An iron. That raises defense, I'm pretty sure. So, not super useful. And our lodging. Uh, and our extra sensory. Critical hit, nice. And that would have been a two hit KO normal. If that wasn't a crit. Okay, so we have to hit the switch. 
and we have to get interrupted by another monster. Well, man, I can easily take care of all these, all these Pokemon here. They're like not even a challenge. She's almost close to leveling up too. Okay, let's hit the switch. I literally shifted just my positioning and I'm getting interrupted. What do you even want, man? I'm just gonna easily get rid of you with my extra sensory. And man's leveled up. 49, nice. We're almost we're getting pretty high levels compared to everything else around here. Uh go ahead, let's let's put you in now. Switch switch. We're not hitting again. And let's go south. And get interrupted again by another wild mod battle. Uh Night Slash should take care of this legend. Almost. We'll get healed up at least from the shell bell. Okay, good, that missed. Will-O-Wisp would have been super annoying. And I did not mean to get Google to uh, respond to me there. You heard that ping, that was my phone. Detect? That is, protect is not a good move in single player. Like, there's no reason to do it, just stalling for one turn. My mentor once lived here. Oh, cool. Was it your mentor Pegasus? Or something? Okay, this is a rock type. We, st we do have a lot of PP on Earthquake, so let's just use it. Easy. Cyclopean. Uh, that's weak to Earthquake too, so I guess we'll just do spam this move. And, what was that, one more Pokemon left? Yeah, one more. Dark Geroid. And that's another Pokemon weak to Earthquake, so... Another Earthquake. All those Pokemon were weak to Earthquake, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, these, these these trainers are not a challenge at all. Woo, overwhelming. So you're stuck? Try jumping off over there. Uh, not right now. I want to explore around here before I do those irreversible jump offs. Like, they're not completely irreversible because they, they have to lead back to the uh, lower floors to let me leave, but I can't go back upwards is what I mean. I just, I don't want to deal with these tra these battles. Okay, Night Slash can take care of this, hopefully. Just go ahead, is not strong enough. And this Will-O-Wisp is going to be super annoying. Just a little bit of PP, like HP damage. It's going to trigger my... It's just going to trigger me. Okay, well let's just heal that up immediately since I have all these... Well, do I have any burn heals actually? I could start using up these just random uh, individual healing items that I have. Yeah, I do. Uh, let's see. Anything over here besides this? An HP up? Nice. That's not too bad. Uh, nope. Okay, so let's take that scientist device and try jumping off. Before we, except we're getting interrupted by a Dark Geroid first. Watch this Earthquake and deal with this. And the Shell Bell heals up. Okay. 
Uh, now let's d actually jump off this time. See where this leads us. Okay, we're over here. And... That didn't do anything. Okay, so I guess we have to jump off from the other one. These Night Slashes are not strong enough. Shadow Punch? That should be not too bad. Uh, actually, that did quite a bit of damage. Not enough to actually be too worrying, though. Okay, let's head back up. Oh, and the switches are still there, like that, for some reason. Ah, uh, do I even want to bother? Whatever, Night Slash is times four effective. This should- this will also heal us up a little, so it's fine. I might just start running from these battles, though, because they're just super annoying. And, like, not giving me- not even giving me that much experience. Okay, let's go turn the switch. And we have to head upwards. Another lodge in. Uh, I'm just gonna start running from these battles. They're just too annoying. And not actually, like, leveling me up that much. Eh, this, eh, this rose made of might give ex good experience. Let's just do a fly. Try to take care of this. Critical hit. Okay, now let's actually go up one one more block. Turn this switch turn this switch. Uh go down. If we don't get interrupted again. Start our uh, PP on this earthquake. I mean, I might as well use up the ethers because I'm not going to use them otherwise. Actually, I might need them for the Elite Four and stuff. Eh, I don't know. Whatever, let's just head down. So this should lead me to somewhere. If I don't get interrupted again. Okay, that fly was actually a bad move. I should have done air cutter there. Unless this kills. Nope. Then he's gonna get healed up. Uh, well, let's just do a fly again. Maybe it, he won't spam Wish. Or he just. Legend's just gonna spam Wish. And I just got why he has Wish. Ah, uh, he's a genie. Oh, uh, I am dumb. I'm dumb. I did not think that. I did not think about that when he was using Wish. Well, let's go down this way. See where that leads us. Okay, that we're actually progressing now. Who are you? There shouldn't be anyone here. Uh, bro, there's a bunch of people in this mansion. Silent Magician level 4, ooh. Uh... That's an Ice type. Uh, but she is frail, so I think this Night Slash should just kill. Okay. Good. Don't have to worry about that. And just one more Pokémon. Guide of Fierce Knight, that's a normal type. Uh, let's use Air Cutter. And it misses, of course. Of course, that's like a 5% chance to miss. And he's gonna get a speed boost, because I, I missed that attack. Okay, let's just try it again. Should hit this time. Yeah, good. Okay, he now is starting to catch up in level 2 now. Ouch! 
A key? I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, sure you don't. Whatever, I'll just do this while I battle, even though d these are just like time wasters. I think I'm almost done. Cause like once you just drop from the uh, top floor, it's pretty straightforward from there, I'm pretty sure. And we're getting glared, nice. I certainly do love status conditions. Okay, just let this air cutter hit and we should be good. Okay. And an unnecessary crit, nice. Okay, what's this item? Nothing important because this Apophis wants to uh, interrupt me. Okay, let's just run away. Uh, I forgot to full heal there. Let's just use these up. I do have paralyzed heals, so I can start using these up before I use up my full heals. Carbos, that increases speed, I'm pretty sure. Not sure how these good that is though. Is that an exit? Uh well let's just do a night slash and see if this kills. Okay, good. Do not want to keep dealing with these guys. Let's see, where's this lead then? Before we head on over. This is the basement floor? We're just gonna run. I do not want to deal with these guys. Uh, okay. We haven't been here before. Diary, October 6th, Cairo, Egypt. It's the three-month anniversary of the release of Duel Monsters, but I'm, now, but I'm now back here in Egypt and I'm standing before what looks like a stone tablet of three gods. I must create them, no matter the cost. Okay, so that's the lore for the Egyptian gods being here. I'm mean, already took down Slifer. Nasty plot. That's that's not too bad. We are faster, and if this air cutter hits, we should be fine. Okay, let's see what you have to say. Uh oh, where am I now? Oh, this is another one of these tubers. I st I still don't get why they're called tubers. Are they like YouTubers or something? Because they. They look like a YouTuber or something? I don't know. It doesn't doesn't really make much sense. And one more. Guy or Dragon Champion. That's a dragon fighting type, so this air cutter should deal with it. And barely surviving, of course. I'll just do an air cutter and hope this hits. Okay, and we're good. And that's... You only have two Pokemon, right? Ah woo! A wow? A wow? How would you pronounce that even? Ah woo! You can find stuff lying around. The residents must have left them. Yeah, that's certainly why you're in here. I'm just gonna run from these battles now. They're just too annoying for me to deal with. Okay, here's another item we can get. A full restore. That's pretty good. Yeah, I do not want to deal with these guys today. I'm only going to do trainer battles from now on. 
And I have to hit the switch here. Did I bring any repels? Because that would just expedite that process a little bit instead of having to run from battles. I don't think so. Well, we're just gonna have to keep running from battles then. Uh, I can interrupt every like 10 steps. Well, let's hit the switch and go out this way. Then head back and go up north. I'm not getting interrupted again. Okay, you're this pisses me off a little too much. You're gonna you're gonna get it this time. Uh let's use a fly. And one more fly should do it. As long as it doesn't miss from because of the sand deck. Well, let's just try it again. See what happens. Barely surviving. Of course. And poison thing. Please don't poison us. Okay, good. And I guess I'll just take care of it with an air cutter. Could get a little, like, one HP of healing there. Yep. Okay, now let's continue on. And oh, another trainer battle. Let's see what you guys say. This place is ideal for a lab. Look at all this space. I mean, it is. it was a lab before. Got, you don't know the lore of this? Summon Skull. Uh, I don't have a, my, I don't have any PP on Earthquake here. I guess we'll just do Night Slash. That is not very effective. So it's an electric dark type. In that case, I sh do have a fighting type. Uh, I could. I'm just gonna spam air cutter though, because I'd rather not switch out. I mean, it, it's only one more hit anyway. Yeah, we're we're pretty over leveled. I mean, kind of hard not. Like last, the last two gems were like 45 was the max, so I don't understand why these guys are so weak. Just keep spamming air cutter. This is my strategy right now. Glare, of course. Uh, I hate paralysis. Like. Paralysis is definitely one of the most annoying status conditions, just cause uh... It's a random luck based thing about whether you you hit or not. What was that for? It's like in your favor cause it's 75%, but that's still annoying enough that it's like a pain in the butt. Well, we're gonna have to he heal that up right now. We got paralyzed heals. Oops. Did not hit, meant to hit that button. I'll just use up these paralyzed heals so I can clear up some bag space. Okay, so there's a switch there. Will I need to hit it? I'm not sure. We are really close to level up. Uh, I think I will actually do this battle though, because Go Head's almost leveled up. Critical hit, nice. Not enough to kill though.
and one air card should do this if it doesn't miss. Uh, it's a 5% chance. Why can't you just hit? And we're getting glared too, of course. Just want to prolong this as long as possible. Okay, and we're done. Just gonna switch go ahead out now. Hopefully this is enough to level up. Like there is- it's just that tiny sliver, right? One more battle with go ahead. Okay. Well, guess I'll use this paralyzed heal again. And let's head over. Oh, it's Mokuba. Okay. Hey, what are you doing here? This is a restricted area. This is going to be the newest location of the Kaiba Corp Amusement Park. Rich Boy Mokuba. Blue Eyes. Ooh, this might be a battle. Oh wait, he's level 35. Okay, yeah, this is not a big deal then. Go ahead, can basically take care of this. And that didn't do too much. Oh, he's using a super potion? Why not? Wait, why not a hyper potion or something better? Barely not killing because of that super potion. Let's just try that again. Okay, he has three more Pokemon left. Go ahead to level 49 now, nice. Almost to level 50. Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon, holy crap. And Intimidate. I mean, that sure is intimidating. Uh, I think... I think I'll switch into mana here. Dragon Rage. Ooh, that... Yeah. Uh, we should still be fine though. Extra sensory should deal a decent amount of damage. Or go crit. Okay, that's that's nice. And two more Pokemon. Swift Gaia. Uh, that's a fighting type, I'm pretty sure, so this extra sensor would definitely kill here. And then one more Pokemon. Is it going to be like Hungry Burger or something? It is Hungry Burger, I knew it. You gotta reference Hungry Burger if you're making a Mokuba battle. Okay, that was easy enough. My bro will not be happy. This mansion is going to get re demolished and replaced with a new amusement park. Okay, uh... So, now that we battled Mokuba, I think I'm gonna call that for this, uh, this episode. So next time, we'll keep continuing to do the Pokemon Mansion, because this is actually a huge dungeon. Uh, but until then, see you guys then. Bye!